whole stubborn Roger McDodger rode into the town of Dick Gulper Basin, hoping to sell a child he caught that last blood moon. Upon entry to the Yellow Hat Saloon Barber and Barbecue Shop, Roger stepped through a crack in the floor and collapsed into the basement. The basement that which happened to be the favorite dick-tugging spot of Jiminy Gape, the crown king of left-footed dog-kicking. <laughs> The latter of which challenged Roger McDodger to a duel on the roof of Timothy Bongwater's moonshine hut at a quarter past seventeen of next year's first Wednesday. The two met at the agreed upon time in the famous Orange Clip Bone Alley and lined up the duel. Roger McDodger didn't believe in guns and so chose to compete with a 12th century trebuchet. Jiminy Gape shot before Roger McDodger could even wind back his 12th century trebuchet and hit Roger McDodger 17 times in the left clavicle. McDodger proceeded to die from tuberculosis 15 seconds later. Jiminy Gape later went on to become legend for single-handedly bringing Lucifer back from hell. <laughs>